it's the Marinus from Killerwater Coaching here. Today I just thought I'd like to talk a little bit about um, <clears throat> managing a bit of a taboo subject which I think should be discussed more um, openly and that's sort of, um, sort of weight management for cyclists. Um, now, yeah, I've had, I've, uh, personally, I can give a bit of background, I've had a... Uh, I've been cycling for a while actually, since I stopped athletics and one thing that got in my way um, from being able to train properly the first time I tried was I, I actually lost far too much weight too quickly and um, so I started off about 75, 76 kilos and I thought, I, thought, I just thought right I'm going to go for cycling, do what I can and, and I lost too much weight too quickly. Um, got down to about I say, under 65 at one point, just too far. Um, so you, obviously you can definitely take it too far. Um, but then on the flip side of that, like 75 kilos, I was too heavy um, to be to ride at the best uh, to, for me to be at my optimal watt per kilo. Because the reality is, uh, cycling is is a watt per kilo sport. Um, you know, it's power to weight is kind of what makes you go up a hill faster. If you're riding on the flat, yeah, it's power to CDA. But even then, fat is just dead weight. Um, and more fat is also, surprisingly, amount more CDA. So the smaller you can be, the faster you'll go on the flat even. Um, but, so I, I think rather than treating as a taboo subject and being, oh, you should never lose weight, um, there should be more information out there about how people should can find their optimum weight and um, get there sensibly without harming themselves. And I think the the key thing there is is as soon as you start, if you're losing weight, as soon as you start seeing a drop off in power, that that'll be the first thing to go. That'll be the first thing you notice. If you lost too much weight too quickly, your power will will, will drop off. And that's when you've got to say to yourself, right, clearly I'm better at this weight. Because what's per kilo, what's per arrow, it is a, it is a, it's a, it's a scale, it's a tipping point. And, and if you, you, you can be as light as you want, but if you've got no watts to push yourself, it's pointless. Um, and I'd say, yeah, you are obviously, you're always, you're better off being a kilo on the heavy side of that scale than pushing it too far and, um, and going the other side because then your health your power it'll drop off a cliff and I just wish I noticed that at the time because um, I just found I was losing motivation to train and uh, I just yeah didn't ride because of it and uh, I wasted a bit of an opportunity there so um, it might take a bit of experimenting but as soon as your power drops off yeah just stop losing weight 